Uh, my name is George Filho. I'm lead business developer of Hoplon Infotainment. Hoplon is a Brazilian company who have now in development uh, a massive social game. Uh, the concept of massive social game is different of the concept of traditional massive multiplayer online game. In the massive multiplayer uh, online game, you have a game. In the massive social game, you have the two uh, kinds of the virtual world. You have games and you have metaverse live uh, exist in the same universe but in different parts in our project we have three games okay and one metaverse inside the same universe and another interesting thing about our game it's our game is generated the, the history for, from the history of three sci-fi Brazilian writers and this is a traditional sci-fi Brazilian history okay <laughs> What excites you most about the current metaverse technology? Sorry? What excites you most about this technology? Uh, about the, 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 the virtual worlds, uh, what excites me more is uh, all my life I have a dream to see parallel worlds, to see virtual worlds. And uh, to me, uh, this universe or this kind of, of the new game is uh, it's become my dreams from my child age, you understand? Okay, yeah. it's this it's, it's, it's most uh, excitable yeah. you, you to me. What concerns do you have about the technology? Does anything concern you? I believe that, 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 that about technology, I, I remember one unique word. The key of technology is interface. And I feel when I see things like iPhone, I see things like Nintendo Wii. And I believe the next step of the metaverse is have a different kind of, of, of the interface. Like, I believe, uh, you connect it directly in your brain and you move your avatar with your brain. Uh, what do you think is going to be the most surprising impact of this technology maybe 10 years out? I believe it's a virtual economy, okay? And I, I believe uh, the virtual economy becoming in the future like uh, real countries. I see Second Life like uh, United States in the golden age, in the golden rush, okay? I see in the virtual worlds, in the virtual economies, the opportunity to make and grow in business uh, in another way to the traditional, okay? Last question, what barriers will this technology never overcome? Oh my god. I believe the, 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 the huge barrier uh, in this technology is uh, the people in different parts of the world speak different languages. Uh, I have this experience because before this game I work, I work with the company who have the Second Life Global Provider license to Brazil. And we just started with the idea to put Second Life in Brazil because it's difficult to the Brazilian people uh, to uh, use the site in English and communicate to the people who speak English because it's not common in Brazil that people speak English.